Tamil Nadu to come up with AI based solutions to prevent elephant deaths. See details by the end of October, the Tamil Nadu Forest Department will finalize the artificial intelligence based solutions to cease elephant deaths in Tamil Nadu. The department has already put out a call for bids from eligible firms and allocated 7 crore rupees for the project. Near the Madukurai Forest Range in Walayar, speeding trains run over elephants frequently, killing numerous wild tuskers. In November 2021, three female elephants were crushed by a speeding Mangalore Chennai Express train. Reportedly, the Tamil Nadu Forest Department even assaulted railway workers after this sparked a significant altercation. Eight elephants have died since 2010 as a result of being hit by trains traveling at high speeds, according to a right to information query. After multiple meetings between the higher officials of the forest divisions of Tamil Nadu and the Southern Railway, it was concluded that artificial intelligence might be used to protect elephants from being run over by speeding trains. According to sources, the Tamil Nadu Forest Department is also in the process of setting up digital data centers and digital archives, thus making the information at their fingertips. Recently, Supriya Sahu, the secretary of the Tamil Nadu Forest Department, stated that the State Forest Department would rely more on technology for conservation efforts. How does artificial intelligence, AI, work on preventing elephant death? District Forest Officer Venkatesh said, artificial intelligence works on wireless-based systems. Rotational cameras will be installed in vulnerable places where traces of elephants are seen. In this way, if any animal crosses the railway track, the signal will be instantly transmitted through the wireless mode. To put it simply, a wireless communication system is connected to a camera, thus, monitoring the movement of animals will be at ease. The system will be implemented at Coimbatore Madukurai and Walayar railway tracks to prevent elephant death. Between Madukurai and Walayar, two railway lines cross the Madukurai forest range. The distance of one stretch is 1.8 km and the other is 2.8 km. Elephant accidents occur frequently on both of these paths since they are popular places for animals to cross. Earlier, GSM via SIM cards was used to monitor animals which faced barriers to transmitting information through towers on the movement of animals. Now, the wireless mode would instantly transfer signals on the movement of animals at any time even during natural calamities. The DFO added that a total of 11 wild elephants were killed on the railway line between Kanjakode and Madukurai stations on the Palakkad Walayar Coimbatore segment in six years. As per recent data, in November last year, three elephants including two female calves were killed by Mangalore Chennai Express, while the elephants were crossing the railway track near Maripalam Thottam on a line between Walayar and Madukurai sections. If you like this video don't forget to subscribe my channel press bell icon button for more videos.